What's up guys? I'm AlphaYT. Today I'm going to be showing y'all how to install fabric for any version of Minecraft that you want to install it for. So, first thing that you're going to want to do, obviously, make sure you got the Minecraft launcher. Don't do Minecraft for Windows because it will not work. You do have to have Java Edition. And then you can either go over here or go over to Installations, click New Installation, and just find whichever version you're going to use. I'm doing 1.20.1, so I already have it uh, created, so I don't need to create another one. So I'm just going to use this one right here. And then make sure that you have played it at least once. By play, I mean just load it up. Then once you're on the main menu, just click Quick Game. And I've already played this multiple times, so I don't need to do that. So once you know that you've played it, just click the red X and then open up your browser. Or you can go to the link in the description because I will have both of these linked. But the link is not working in the description. You're going to want to go to fabricmc.net. Go over to New Installation. Click Download here. Download Universal Jar, because this will work for any version of Java. Then switch over to Fabric API, or just go to the description. But if it doesn't work, again, just go over to curseforge.com, then do Fabric API right here. Files, and then I'm doing 1.20.1, so I'm just going to do the latest one right here. Then just click download, and it should download in like about 5 seconds, so not very long. And then there we go. And then another really important thing, which I probably should have mentioned before, is that if you do not have Java installed, I'll have this linked in the description too. You're gonna wanna go to java.com, click download, and then just download the latest version here and then install it. Otherwise, um, this will not work because you definitely need to have Java for both Forge and for Fabric. So yeah, just make sure that you have Java installed, but if you know you have it installed, don't install it again. Otherwise, it, it'll be weird. So then once you have everything installed, just click minus or X, doesn't really matter. Open up your downloads here. I'm gonna go over to my downloads. And then Fabric Installer, you wanna right click, open with, then Java. Should take about a few minutes to load, maybe a few seconds depending on how good your computer is. My computer isn't that great. All right, so you should see this pop up once you have opened up Fabric. And then just select whichever version you're doing. Again, I'm doing 1.20.1, so I'm just gonna use this. Don't do anything with this one. I don't think it really matters, but just click install. And yeah, it should start installing. All right, so once this is installed, it will say successfully installed. Just click OK. And then you can just click the X up here. Open up your Minecraft launcher. All right, guys, so once you load up uh, Minecraft, it should say fabric loader, and then whichever version you got it for. Next, start what you're gonna wanna do, go to installations, and then click on the file button over here. Then, okay, yeah, it should bring you to your files. Then you're gonna wanna look for mods double click on it there we go and then you're going to want to open up your files again and go over to wherever you saved fabric api mine would be in my downloads so then i'm just going to take fabric api drag it into here and then just drag whatever mods that you want to put in here too and then if you go over to minecraft then you also are able to install shaders and stuff with it too so that's pretty much it and then you can just play minecraft and it should work and so yeah i really hope you guys enjoyed this video uh, please let me know if something did work for you guys. Please like and subscribe if it did. And as always, I am AlphaYT, and I'll see you guys later. Oh.